Welcome to Reptile HQ. Today, we will cover basic care guidelines involved with owning a snapping turtle as a pet. Let's begin. Housing. Snapping turtles require a spacious and secure enclosure that mimics their natural habitat. For juveniles, a 40-gallon tank or larger is suitable, while adults require an even larger custom-built enclosure or an outdoor pond setup. A larger enclosure allows for more swimming space and promotes natural behaviors. The enclosure should provide both land and water areas. Use a sturdy and escape-proof lid or fencing to prevent the turtle from getting out. Water quality. Maintaining clean and appropriate water quality is crucial for the health of snapping turtles. Install a water filtration system to remove waste, debris, and excess nutrients from the water. Regularly test the water parameters such as temperature, pH level, around 6.5 to 7.5, ammonia, nitrite, and nitrate levels to ensure they are within the acceptable range. Partial water changes should be performed regularly, typically around 25% every two weeks to prevent the buildup of harmful toxins. Water and land temperature. Snapping turtles are ectothermic, meaning they rely on external sources to regulate their body temperature. Maintaining proper water and basking temperatures is essential for their health and metabolism. Use a submersible heater to maintain the water temperature between 7580 degree F, 2427 degree C. Place a basking lamp or ceramic heat emitter in the land area to create a basking spot with a temperature of 8590 degree F, 2932 degree C. Use thermometers to monitor and ensure proper temperature gradients throughout the enclosure, allowing the turtle to thermoregulate as needed. UVB lighting. Snapping turtles require access to UVB light for proper calcium metabolism and vitamin D3 synthesis. UVB radiation helps turtles produce vitamin D3, which is essential for calcium absorption and maintaining healthy bones and shell growth. Use a high-quality UVB lamp specifically designed for reptiles and follow the manufacturer's guidelines for distance and duration of exposure. It's crucial to provide a UVB lamp that emits a sufficient amount of UVB radiation for the specific enclosure size and the turtle's needs. Regularly replace the UVB bulb every 6, 12 months to maintain optimal UVB output. Substrate. In the water area of the enclosure, use smooth river rocks or aquarium-safe gravel as a substrate. These materials allow for easy cleaning and prevent the turtle from accidentally ingesting substrate while feeding. In the land area, provide a substrate that promotes burrowing behavior, such as a mixture of organic soil, sand, and coconut fiber. This substrate should be moist enough to hold its shape, but not overly wet to avoid excessive humidity. Feeding. Snapping turtles are opportunistic omnivores and have a diverse diet. Offer a variety of prey items to ensure a balanced diet. Their diet should include fish, such as minnows or feeder fish, insects like crickets, mealworms, or waxworms, worms, crustaceans, such as shrimp or crayfish, and commercially available turtle pellets. Include occasional plant matter like dark leafy greens, aquatic plants, and fruits to provide additional nutrients. Avoid feeding them toxic or harmful prey items, as well as food high in fat or lacking in nutritional value. Feeding frequency. The feeding frequency for snapping turtles depends on their age and size. Juvenile snapping turtles should be fed daily or every other day to support their growth and development. As they mature, reduce the feeding frequency to every two, three days for adult turtles. Adjust the feeding schedule based on the turtle's appetite, growth rate, and activity level. Keep in mind that overfeeding can lead to obesity and health problems, so monitor their body condition and adjust accordingly. Environmental Enrichment Providing a stimulating and enriching environment is essential for the well-being of snapping turtles. Offer a combination of aquatic and land-based enrichment items to mimic their natural habitat. Floating logs, rocks, hiding spots, and branches can provide opportunities for climbing, exploring, and basking. Rearrange the enclosure periodically to provide new stimuli and simulate natural changes in the environment. This helps prevent boredom, encourages natural behaviors, and promotes mental and physical stimulation. Handling. Snapping turtles are not recommended for regular handling as they can become stressed and potentially bite. They have powerful jaws and sharp beaks that can cause injury. If handling is necessary for health checks or maintenance, 
always wash your hands thoroughly before and after. Handle them with extreme caution, supporting their body securely to avoid injury to both you and the turtle. Minimize handling time to reduce stress. Veterinary care. Regular veterinary checkups are essential to ensure the overall health of your snapping turtle. Find a reptile experienced veterinarian who can provide routine health exams, fecal tests for parasites, and guidance on proper care and husbandry. They can also offer advice on nutrition, habitat setup, and any specific health concerns. Watch for signs of illness such as loss of appetite, lethargy, abnormal behavior, or shell abnormalities, and seek veterinary attention promptly if needed. Regular veterinary care plays a crucial role in maintaining the long-term health and well-being of your snapping turtle. Remember, snapping turtles are long-lived creatures that require a long-term commitment. Proper care, nutrition, and environmental conditions are vital to their health and well-being. Always research the specific needs of the species you are keeping and ensure you are adhering to any local laws or regulations regarding keeping snapping turtles as pets.